because this video is going to be all about the 2025 Porsche Cayenne EV, a new all-electric chassis and powertrain, which will form the second pillar of the brand's future SUV portfolio, have been concealed by the first prototype of the next-generation Porsche Cayenne SUV, which has landed on the icy roads of Lapland. An enormous obstacle will be waiting for the 2025 Cayenne, which is based on the PPE platform debuted by the new Mekong. If it comes to fruition, it will need to join the Mekong while maintaining the same level of success as the previous three generations. The premium SUV market of the future is fiercely competitive. The Cayenne has always played a significant role in the German brand's lineup, and it is now second only in sales to the Mekong in terms of total vehicles sold. Since the existing gas-powered Cayenne has recently had a substantial upgrade, it is anticipated that it will be sold alongside the new electric vehicle. There will be an 800V electrical system in the new Cayenne, much like in the smaller Mekong. This system can enable charging up to 270 kilowatts in its current application. Furthermore, its adaptability allows it to divide 800V systems when linked to a charger that is intended for 400V systems, eliminating the need for a converter and so reducing weight and complexity. However, Porsche has already said that a new K1 flagship crossover will replace the Cayenne in 2026, so the new Cayenne won't remain a flagship SUV model for very long after its 2025 debut. A brand new platform developed for Porsche will serve as the model's foundation. The next-gen Taycan and Panamera will incorporate the SSP Sport's innovative battery and chassis technologies. The material is mostly theoretical, so proceed with caution despite the source's credibility. Your opinion on this matter would be greatly appreciated.